Hi, I'm Delilah Brennan. I'm one of the nurses in the same day surgery pre-op area and I will be getting you ready for your surgery. On the day of your procedure, you'll be brought back to the same day surgery pre-op area where you'll be shown to your private cubicle to prepare for your procedure. One of our staff will record your height, weight, and vital signs, and please give us any paperwork you might have at this time, uh, which could include notes from your doctor, lab or EKG requisitions, medicine lists, allergies to medicines, or any information you might have about your health history or advanced directives. We'll also verify your full name and date of birth at this time. After you and our staff member have checked that your name band is correct, it will be placed on your wrist. Staff will check your name band at key times to ensure your safety. If you pre prefer to be called by a nickname or a middle name, please let our staff member know. We'll make a note on the front of your chart. Then it's time to change into your hospital gown. If you need to use the bathroom, please check with a staff member to see if a urine specimen is needed first. Safe containers will be provided for glasses, hearing aids, or dentures. Any jewelry or personal items like purses, wallets, or cell phone you didn't leave at home should be given to your family or placed in one of our lockers for additional security. Your pre-op nurse will work with you for approximately 45 minutes to an hour to make sure you're ready for your procedure. The nurse will perform a brief physical exam focusing on the area of surgery. If you received a call from our pre-admission screening nurse, your health history, medications, allergies, and any prior surgical procedures should already be in our computer database. At this time, all data will be verified and placed in your chart. We'll need to know the last date, time, and dose of each of your medications. If any lab tests, EKG, or x-rays are necessary before your surgery, we'll take care of them along with any other tasks ordered by your doctor. This might include scrubbing or hair clipping for orthopedic procedures. After asking if there are any special considerations or requests regarding your IV site, our expert pre-op staff will start your IV, taking special care to make this experience as quick and painless as possible. Your nurse will verify your time of surgery and its expected duration. After a brief review of what to expect in the recovery room, your family members will be informed about the family waiting area, post-op physician conference, and when they can expect to see you after surgery. Admitted patients will go to their assigned rooms and their families will meet them there. Patients being discharged to go home will meet their families when the patient is ready to leave the hospital. Your nurse will explain the pickup process. Please make sure your family member is prepared to meet with the recovery nurse to review your discharge instructions. Although our goal is to keep all of our surgeries on time, there is potential for surgeries to be delayed due to unforeseen circumstances. Sometimes your doctor may be urgently called to another case or the previous surgery may run longer than expected. Our staff will keep you updated regarding a delay should one occur. Shortly before your procedure, you'll be visited by your surgeon, your anesthesiologist, and your operating room nurse. They will answer any further questions you might have and will take very good care of you throughout your surgery. Hello, my name is Jamie and I am one of the nurses from the operating room. The first time that you'll see the members of the operating room staff, you should be finished or almost finished getting ready in the pre-op area. The surgeon, anesthesiologist, and the OR nurse will speak with you prior to taking you back for your surgery. Although we have looked at the information in your chart, we will be asking you a lot of the same questions. This is a safety check for you and it's very important. Once we have all spoken with you and the surgeon has marked the operative site, we will be heading back to the OR. The OR will be cold. We keep the temperature low for a number of reasons, such as keeping bacteria levels at a minimum and keeping our surgical staff comfortable while they are working. This being said, keeping you warm is one of our top priorities, especially to help promote post-op healing. We have warming blankets on the bed underneath the sheets, and upon entering the OR, we'll be giving you some warm blankets. And once you are asleep, we can put specialized warming blankets on you as well. Once you're in the OR and have your warm blankets, we'll have you move over to the operating room table. It's very narrow, so please be careful as you move over. When you're settled in, we'll give you some arm boards to rest your arms on and apply the monitors so that we can watch you while you're with us. We'll put a blood pressure cuff on, an EKG to watch your heartbeat, and a pulse ox to watch your oxygen levels. 
We will also place a safety strap across your thighs. This is just a reminder as to how narrow our bed is. Next, your anesthesiologist will start giving you medication through your IV to help you relax. Due to this medication, you may not even remember being in the OR at all. At this point, we will have you take some deep breaths of oxygen through a mask, and your anesthesiologist will put more medication through your IV as you drift off to sleep. A breathing device may be inserted to assist you with breathing or to keep your airway clear. If you have a breathing device, you may wake up with a sore throat. After your surgery is complete, we will move you back onto your bed and take you to the recovery room. Although you will be awake prior to leaving the OR, you probably won't remember much until you have been in the recovery room for a while. As you arrive in the recovery room, we will give your nurse a thorough report about your medical history and the surgery that was performed. You will be in great hands there.